name is Kristen Selig and I'm the Nursing Lab Coordinator here at the School of Nursing at Northern Illinois University and I'm going to demonstrate an oxygen tank. This oxygen tank carries liquid oxygen and might be used in the home or um, when traveling from one department to another within a hospital setting. And the oxygen tank here, um, the green part is where the liquid oxygen is stored and this is called the regulator. And the regulator it tells us if the tank is full and how full it is. And then um, the side here has a dial control, so you can set how many liters per minute that the patient would receive. So if uh, an average would be like two liters per minute, you would set it at the two. And then the patient would simply place the cannula. And that's what this is called, a nasal cannula. And it simply sticks in their nose and kind of goes up under their chin like an old cowboy hat would. And um, there's different forms, but if a patient is at home, this is typically what they would wear. Um, oxygen tanks help them by giving a patient who may not be um, breathing well on room air, gives them a little extra oxygen to circulate throughout their blood and feed their organs a little bit better.